I guess I might as well unpack. Alright, well that was definitely interesting. Little outburst there. Oh god. Shoo Shoo's gonna look so grungy on this nice bed. She's gotten me through some hard times, but I was hoping we were done with that. I know I kicked the drywall crack when I see one. But it looks like Mr. John Chen left San Miguel County about six months after his arrival. Yeah, is, is there like a forwarding address on file? I'm sorry, sir. That's not information we retain. Thanks. Looks like we've both had people trying to help us. I'm glad it made a difference for Gabe. Okay. We're doing this. We are doing this. We got to beat his record. No. Dang cart got us. I think I messed up. Oh, I'm on my, okay. Ah. Uh. It's fine. We did decent. <laughs> Gabe looks like he fits right in. We did all right. Oh, man. Gabe used to crush me. Jerk. Is that a sword? Huh. They've really changed the art style since I read these. Must be Ethan's. Wonder how many times Gabe, Gabe brushing up on comics and art. Really going the extra mile for Ethan and Charlotte. Broadcasting straight from your local record store. Because how fucking... Whoa. Looks like Ryan turned my brother into a model citizen. Alright, I... We pretty much looked at everything except for a few drawers. So we want to make sure we get this... Alex, do I want to know? Guess I kind of gave Gabe the runaround, huh? Anita and Eduardo. They were one of the good ones. 
Wow. Gabe's been looking for me for a while. So Gabe and Riley have been working on her interview, and Mac thought they were sleeping together. I like the rib. Let's go with the rib. Unpack the ribs first. Ethan's really talented. I never heard back from Sydney. At least she cared. More than I can say for I really wish those meds had worked. Right, I'm telling you, his story doesn't add up. He wants you. He's helping me get into college, baby. You know dudes can do nice things without the expectation of getting laid, right? A high school dropout? A guy who went to a fucking juvie? Wants to be your study buddy? What, out of the goodness of his heart? Oh my god, Mac, we're friends. There is nothing going on between Gabe and me. That guy seems like a total ass. Gabe always Falling wanted a bike now. like this. All right, let's unpack some photos. Crazy how much we've changed. No way. Guess Gabe didn't cut out our parents. How mature. Look at them. Mom's healthy. Dad's only kind of an asshole. My journal. Time to add my latest meltdown. Ugh. I'll finish this later. No fucking way.
Well, Alex, you just went nuts and beat the shit out of somebody in front of your brother. So, how are you feeling right now? See, I, I really wish that, and that, I mean, all right, the game's pretty good so far, but I have one complaint. I really do wish they added some sort of, like, music, soundtrack, or something like that for people who turned off licensed music. Because it kind of takes the emotional part out of Life is Strange. And in my personal opinion, it kind of ruins the game. So one thing I do really, really, that I don't like about the game. Which I've never said that about any Life is Strange before. But this one, I do have a complaint. And that's the... They don't have any music for if you turn it off. So, like, right now, these key moments, it's really miss missing that emotion that could be brought in from the music. I'm a little disappointed about. I'm not going to lie. Like I said, I did get this game on uh, on a Steam sale, but still. Um, I mean, I would have loved to see some some sort of sound that's not licensed to put over it's kind of taken out of the key point and i'm i'm tempted to just take the take the risk here and um unmute it because we're really missing like the emotion part behind it because you can't even hear hear her sing that's the worst part and like it's not the actual song because she's singing. Feeling damn surprises, Gabe. I don't know. Kind of disappoints me. I'm not gonna lie. Being here is too good to be true. I'm not gonna let anything mess it up. I should go downstairs and set things right with Gabe. Brian, just forget it. Stop that. You need to take care of yourself. Got Mac patched up. Let's take a look at you now. Oh, looks pretty nasty right about here. Uh. <laughs> so, it hurts when you breathe? Alex, you made it. Charlotte, right? I'm sorry you had to see that fight. What a terrible first impression. Dad, I'm taking Gabe to the station. We need a first aid kit that doesn't predate the discovery of bacteria. It's fine, I don't need to go. Well, Ryan knows what he's doing, now you just go with him. Alex, I'll be back soon, okay? Okay. Well, there goes my bartender and my backup bartender. I love that. It's a falling star? Yeah. Or rising. Depends on the day, I guess. So... What's it doing today? Wow. <laughs> I don't know. Today's been a roller coaster so far. I can't imagine. I heard Ethan gave you an issue of his comic. He obviously thinks you're really cool. I know literally nothing about kids, but he seems like one of the good ones. I appreciate that. He's my favorite person. 
By the way, thanks for telling us about the mine. Ethan's not allowed up there anymore. Yeah, no problem. I hope you won't be mad at me. You did the right thing. Beef pie special. Watch the gravy. <laughs> Jed, you didn't have to. Now, Ryan said you're skipping dinner. No starving artists on my watch. I do have to get going. I'm making some pieces for the spring festival and they have to be done tonight. Sorry, I couldn't talk longer. Oh, that's okay. So glad you're here, Alex. I'm looking forward to getting to know you. Yeah, same. Bye, thanks for supper. Yep. So I'm short-staffed at the moment. Gabe tells me you've worked at a restaurant before. A couple years experience as a server? Uh... Maybe not as long as that, but yeah, I've done lots of things. You want to work a shift? See if you might like it here? Sure. All right. So, we have a few folks that need checking on. Ducky and Diane over there. Steph over here. Uh, there's a table in the back that needs clearing also. You can give the food orders to me, and I'll handle anyone here at the bar. All right? Got it. It's really nice to have you here, Alex. Thanks. Guess I'm a server now. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. My dad was I should check on that table. Can I get you to anything? Miss Chen, here at last to relieve our suspense. Hi. I am Reginald McAllister, the third, ducky to friends, former entrepreneur, now retired. And this young woman is Diane. Hey there. Nice to meet you. I didn't realize that... Uh, that we all knew you were coming? Yes. Gabe is generous with uh, both friendship and information. You're from Portland, right? I moved here from D.C. six months ago. How are you finding the small town thing? I didn't really know what to expect, but it's kind of perfect. <laughs> it feels like a home. I know, I know. I really thought I would hate it. Then I saw the mountains, met some people, and now I'm never leaving. Diane is a geologist, recently working as a process manager for Typhon Mining. I'm glad there's another newbie around here, too. Can I get you anything? Oh, yeah, we're super hungry. I'd love a pie special with fries. Cheeseburger with mushrooms, and my usual to drink. Jed will know what to do. All right, I'll go put that order in. Thanks. My dad was in the service. Hey, Jed. Yeah. I've got an order from Ducky and Diane. Go ahead. One cheeseburger with mushrooms. Uh-huh, and? One pie special with fries. Ducky asked for his usual? Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's fond of a particular rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. Oh, that's odd. I don't see it. Oh, now wait. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. Yeah, he and Gabe went on carousing long after closing. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Serves him right if you ask me, but feel free to go upstairs and look for it. I'm sure he'd be grateful. Oh, if you can't find it, Deputy Pike was with them. Might have some idea. 
He's usually in here around now. Probably arriving soon. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Typhon's not a bad company. Wow. Tetanus anyone? I hope Brian's got better supplies. Still want to hit the trails later this week? You kidding? We're gonna try and find the whiskey. All right, let's see if I can find Ducky's whiskey up here. What an honor to be the sister of the Rubber Duck Derby second plate. Ooh, now I know where the ramen is. No whiskey, though. Maybe Ducky left his whiskey up there? Nope. Nothing. This all looks really fancy, but no rye whiskey. I'm not sure where they would have put the whiskey. Charlotte made this? Gabe mentioned she was an artist, but I didn't realize he meant, like, professionally. I could never make something so personal. I don't see it. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's- Oh, hey. Someone made a course about my life. scared at least he's not freaking out anymore he won't make me lose control holy shit can I talk to you real quick what do you want listen what happened upstairs was fucked up, right? From both of us. Where are you going with this? Look, Riley's headed over here. She's pretty heated. I, I, I don't think it helps to recap all the gory details, you know? So, you're saying you want me to lie to cover your ass? No. No, just, like, let me handle it. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. We've been together four years. She is the best thing that's ever happened to me. But, so please, but he treats him like shit. Out. No, Chief. I don't know, man. Shit. What the fuck 
is wrong with you? Oh my god, look at your face. No, it's okay. Don't even. What were you thinking? Where's Gabe? Why do you give a shit? Because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him. I swear. This is it. You better have a good explanation or... We're done. It's, it's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you! About... Why you guys are meeting behind my back. Okay. So, how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched me! Okay, um... Not exactly sucker punched, but... He definitely started it. Oh god. Were you there too? Yeah, I was there. Max telling you a whole lot of bullshit. You know what? That doesn't even surprise me anymore. So what really happened? That guy's an ass. Riley. Mac barged in, accused Gabe of sleeping with you, sucker punched him, and then kicked him while he was down. Riley, listen. What happened to Mac's face? I did that. Oh, good. Damn. It sounds like he deserved it. Thanks for telling me the truth, Alex. Wait. Wait, are you... Are we okay? Are you fucking serious? I'm so embarrassed by you right now. But are we still together? What do you think, you fucking idiot? No. Alex Chen? Uh... Assaulting Mac Loudon on your first day here, huh? I'm Jason Pike, the deputy sheriff. I'm gonna have to take you in for questioning. Are you saying I'm under arrest? <laughs> your face. <laughs> you should see your face. Oh, jeez. No, <laughs> oh, I'm only kidding. Nobody's in trouble here. I... <laughs> Even I just like to prank each other. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been pranked by a cop before. <laughs> you definitely got me. <laughs> Thanks for being a good sport. Can I buy you a drink? Um, maybe. I'm working right now. Well, I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? <sighs> that, that was pretty funny, I'm not gonna lie. I was like, bruh, I know damn well that did not I'm gonna tell my campaign. Glad you could fill in today. Ah, fuck. Ducky? Jed thinks you took your whiskey up to Gabe's yesterday. Do you know where you might have left it? I remember absolutely nothing of the night. <laughs> Really? Maybe check your phone. Did you take any pictures? Call anyone? <clears throat> Have a look. For goodness sake. Nice. Poor Ducky. I shouldn't be reading this. Sorry, nothing useful. Well, thanks for letting me know. My dad was in the service. Starting over from scratch like this? Fucking terrifying is what it is. You're telling me. Starting over from scratch Sorry, like this? 
fucking terrifying is what it is. Oh, good. I think I need to go to one of these people now. I don't. Christ, she did that to that guy's face? It's steering clear. Aw, I'm already making friends. if the bullet's still in there. Rest in peace, mister. It's getting better for sure. Uh, we're gonna go talk to her, then we'll talk to Pike. Shoot. Sure. That looks radioactive. Alex, right? I'm Steph. Hey. Just seeing if you need food or anything. Oh no, I'm good. Thanks though. Sorry I couldn't hang out at the record store. I've got some time now though if you want to chat. So are you um here with somebody? Or that's Ryan's stuff. Apparently he ditched me for Gabe. They went to get first aid. <laughs> Being a hero again. Ryan's always doing that. <laughs> it's a Lucan family thing. Have you heard about Jed's rescue? It was a big deal. Back when he was a minor, he saved- I can't imagine. Alex wants an earload of Haven trivia just now. Sorry, Jed. He doesn't like to brag, but there's stuff about it all over the place if you look. Interesting. Is that record store inventory? <laughs> no, it's character stats. Do you know what a LARP is? I've heard the term before. Live action role play. It's like a tabletop role-playing game, but acted out in real life. Costumes, foam weapons, beanbag spells. It's great. Gabe was talking about a LARP with Ethan. Yeah, it's next week. They're coming with me. It's their first time. I'm so excited. <laughs> Would you ever want to join us sometime? Sure, I'd try it. If you and Gabe both like it, it must be super fun. Awesome. Is that your shot? What is that? This is bedazzled kiwi schnapps. No one's ever ordered it, so Gabe's trying to get rid of it with the jukebox game. What's a jukebox game? It's like a short version of 20 questions where you're trying to guess a song, guess wrong. You have to take the shot. <laughs> Ryan and I are going to play. You want to take his place? Dude, you're on. <laughs> yes. So, I'll pick a song. You have five yes or no questions before you have to guess it. Okay. Let me guess, it's gonna be muted.
person's name in it? Nope. Okay. Last question. Yeah, all right, I know. Is there an animal on the cover art? Uh, no, no animals. Ugh, too bad. Some of these are really cute. I know, right? That's your five. Ready to guess? Yeah. Let me look through one last time. Here's what I know. The band name doesn't have a person's name in it. The band name does have a symbol in it. No curse words in the song title. No animals on the cover. The band name is on the cover. Think that's enough to figure it out? We'll see. I'm feeling, I'm feeling this one, but they didn't say it had a sim, it doesn't have a symbols. Man, this is kind of hard. Um, Is it that one? I'm probably going to have to drink it. No, it's not. Sorry. All right. Let her drink me. It's not as bad as it looks. <laughs> How was it? It's actually delicious. <laughs> you should try one. Hey, thanks for playing. I'm really glad we did. Me too. I should get back to work. Okay. I've done what Jed asked me to do. I should see if he needs anything else. Guess I'm gonna have to step up my game. Hey, Alex. Well, I've got to get back to work. Later, Alex. I didn't mean to click that. Back again? I'm ready to take you up on that drink. All right. Hey, hey Jed, can we get... Uh... Thanks. And keep it quick. She's on the clock. <laughs> You know, your brother's been talking about you getting here for months. I'm starting to get the sense. I even remember exactly the day he found your number. He was telling everybody in this place. Really? Yeah. Pretty heartwarming stuff. Were you hanging out with Ducky and Gabe last night? Who told? <laughs> <laughs> so... Ducky apparently lost his favorite whiskey. Possibly upstairs? I don't know. You remember seeing him with it? Oh, when I left, he was still down here. Oh, but you know what? You should check Gabe's wall of shame. Might have some incriminating evidence. <laughs> okay, thanks. I will. Well, I've got to get back to work. Later, Alex. All right. Wall of shame. Good shit. Some advice. This one's from yesterday. Hold up. It was Colonel Ducky on Gabe's couch with the bottle. Oh. We know where it is now.
Found this upstairs. In Gabe's couch? What a relief. Many thanks, Alex. My pleasure, Ducky. Can I pour you a glass? Uh, no, no. Allow me. To Miss Alex Chen, a most tenacious detective. To Alex. Cheers. On what Jed asked me to do. I should see if he needs anything. Are you finished up with everything you want to do? Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boys should be back soon. Well, speak of the devil. How you feeling? Not great. Not awful. I got Alex covering for you. For real? We need to talk. I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Okay. I think that's enough for today. You did great work. You'll be a damn fine addition to our team. Not to mention, you can sure hold your liquor. <laughs> you can't keep an injured man waiting. You better go upstairs. Thanks. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Time to talk to Gabe. 